You are the Ratchelor, a single rat looking for love. You'll meet many rats and choose who to keep round after round until you find true love. Um, which rat am I? I this is the only rat that doesn't give me creepy vibes, so I'm going to go with that one. Onwards. Meet my suitors. Select your seven contestants. Um, I'm not here to make friends. My ideal rat partner is like Stuart Little. Let's paint a beautiful future together, Lee. Let oh, my dog's coughing up a hairball. You okay, bud? I'll always stop for you. I'll always take a pause and make sure you're you're doing okay. Once I get to affiliate, I I just need to play the game. But once I get to affiliate, one of the channel point redeeming reward things is going to be give the pup some loving, you know? Because I feel like he could use that. Um, I do like Le Artiste. That's very romantic. And I like art. Sorry, I was distracted by the moon. You could say I'm sick with love. Definitely a rat. Hmm, I'll get back to this guy. Just a robot looking to learn what love is. Oh, Reggie, I love that. You just can't quit me. I can't quit you. Uh, lots of kids. I mean, I guess regardless who I'm going with, I'm probably going to have a lot of kids. Unless if I'm a gay rat. I could be a gay rat. I'm complicated. It's complicated. I don't slow down for anybody. I would hate guys like this on dating apps. Never underestimate the importance of a joyful overcoat. I like that. Put a little sparkle in your life. Glip. <laughs> I don't know why I like that. I don't know what that means. Blueberries are seasonal, but I eat them every day. Hempleton. Oh, gosh. I need to reconsider. Every rose has its thorns. I'm a big rat with a big heart. Who, me? Hello. Do you like cheese? Oh, hi, hey, hi. One-eared Jerio. I like to think I'm reliable. Let's do one-eared Jerio and, um... A real rat. I want to know his story. Chit chat. Hibberdeen. Oh wow. Okay. Okay, Hibberdeen. Wow, he loved that. Bonjour, je m'appelle l'artiste. Oh, I'm sorry. I just got back from France and I always forget to switch languages. Is my accent le not <laughs> le noticeable? Um. Oh. Oh wow. Oh, he liked that. And that wasn't a French accent. Hempleton! I mean, I think all things are nice. My best friend is a ladybug, and I always bring him raspberries from the store. I'm so glad you're here, Hempleton. He kind of liked that. Unless there's a different reaction every time. One year, Jerio. Do you want to go down to the park with me sometime? I used to go there all the time as a kid, and I know where the loveliest dandelion patch grows, just behind the community center. They're so pretty and lovely, you'd fit right in. Oh, we can have a picnic! I value you. <laughs> that, that sounds like a nice date idea. Ooh. Reggie, two, three, one. Imagine there is no heaven, no religion, too. Nothing to live or die for. And above us, only the sky. Grew my first begonias last year, and they changed my life. <laughs> Very interesting. Uh, uh oh. No big deal. But did you know I actually starred in your favorite movie? Yeah, well, that was me. I looked different at the time, though. I did my makeup. Yikes. Yeah, yikes, real rat. I used to live by the Westfield Center with my brothers, but we always stayed in the community, cent community garden over the fence. One day we got pretty bored and decided to wander over and see what all the fuss was about. Shops, clothes, a whole new world right in front of me. Wow! I like your outfit. Who gets a rose? I've actually never watched The Bachelor or The Bachelorette. Um, but man. Okay, definitely Le Artiste. Hempleton was pretty good. I am a fan of Reggie. I love Odie. God, I don't want to waste a rose on a real rat, but I also want to see what happens. Hibberdine and Hempleton. I'm getting them mixed up. I'm gonna go with a real rat. Oh, he's smiling now. And Hempleton. Aww. Oh, okay, sorry guys. Sorry, Hibberdine and Jerio. More chit chat. Ooh. You wanted to learn more about my work? Yeah, sometimes I host Saturday Night, Light, I don't know, Saturday Night Live and also Wheel of Fortune and Dancing with the Stars. Ever seen Avengers by Marvel? I was the Avenger. 
I, I want to say yikes, but I also want him to like me, so wow. Wow, a real rat. Wow. Anyways, yeah, so after I went to the main showroom, I said, wow, after a couple times visiting, I found a toy store and they had some pretty cool tiny clothes that fit. Taught myself a sew after that, though. So many styles. Fabrics to be all things Tron. Lovely. Every outfit is an adventure. Adventure. Hmm, they talk a lot. Wow, you're so different. Not really. I don't have a lot of time to talk. Not a lot of good conversation for, for me to play off on with Odie. I've worked at the grocers for a while. I like seeing all the regulars and helping them get their favorite berries. Garrett always asks for my cheese recommendations since I know a lot about what's in stock. I'm so glad you're here, Hempleton. I like your nose, by the way. Mima had me and the rest of the litter in some sweet old lady's kitchen cupboard, but turns out her nephew wasn't so sweet. Put out a lot of no-kill traps, but then he sent us to the lab for a paycheck that we didn't even get to cash out. I was in there for six months. That's 84.23% of my life. I'm- you know what? I'm glad you're here, Reggie. I'm glad you got out. Aww. Aw, I like Reggie. I like his little bear. I brought you some cheese. The best kind. Uh, this is Le American fromage <laughs> that I have this stolen from the two-story Italian supermarket and then fermented in French sewers for six months. Do you want more it? Let's eat it together, Odani. Wow! <laughs> I like that he drew a picture of someone who's clearly not me. Ah, uh, I'm gonna have to say no to Odie. I feel like they talk a lot. And these four all kind of got my heart, honestly. I like that there's cheese in the bouquet. When I was a kid, me and all my siblings used to jump the fence and tend to our neighbor's garden before she got home each day. She won the biggest cucumber at the county fair and we were so proud. I appreciate you sharing. That's a, that's a nice little story. You are the more beautiful than the thousand million sunsets of the French Revolution. I would paint you with a feeble swipe of my brush, but your essence is uncapturable. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay. I, I like the layout least. At around month five in the lab, I met Ride 449 medium-sized rat, normal build, robot arm, and I said, Whoa, where did you get that? Interesting? Did you ask at the robot arm? Hey, on a more personal note, I've been thinking a lot about a moment in my childhood when I lost my tail. I got caught in a trap and it was torn right off. My mom took care of me and it grew right back. That's what I'm looking for in a partner. Someone who will be there for me when I need them. Like a mother figure? Yikes. Yeah, yikes a real rat. I'm not here to mama you. I'm here to be your partner. Oh, God. You know what? Next, next round, I will choose a real rat. I will choose them to be the rat of my, my dreams. But for now, I'm being serious. I was making a fruit salad the other day and I found the lovely strawberry. It had a flower attached to it and it smelled so sweet. It reminded me of you, actually. I brought it for you. Here it is. Oh, I, I appreciate you sharing. Aw, Templeton. You are the déjà vu of my future. I would regard as your lovey visage <laughs> if it were possible. It's so hard to do a French accent on its own, but specifically with this dialogue. I'd never blink again so that I would gaze at you always. A picture is worth a thousand million words. I'm kind of going into Russian German <laughs> at this point. But to behold you is worth ten billion thousand million. I'm glad you're here. You're making this interesting, Le Artiste. Le Artiste or Le Artiste? I don't know. Turns out Frank 44 got a paper cut while filing some documents, and he didn't bleed. And he looked at the cut, and turned out the whole robo leg was hiding in there. He did some digging, and it turns out he wasn't the only one. Ended up being my dad was a robot mouse, and my mom was a normal house mouse. They fell in love and had me. Oh, so you weren't given this stuff in the lab? You were born with it? I value you. I value you as a robot and mouse. A quarter robot? Three, three-fourths mouse? Hempleton definitely. Hempleton's wonderful. Oh, 
I'm sorry, Lartiste. I'm kind of interested in what Reggie has to say. I need to- I think I'm gonna pick Hempleton, but... Wow. I brought you some more raspberries and strawberries. I know the catering here is great, but I think there's nothing better than a sweet, small strawberry. I'm so glad you're here, Hempleton. Dad was an experiment and had no idea he wasn't real. Anyways, 4-4 helped me get out of there after he realized the truth, but not before he and J-O-J-O-9-8- <laughs> I said J-O-J-O. Figured out how to disable the tracking software running in our wires, rewrote it with some Bitcoin miner, so we make a small sum as long as we don't skip out on our sleep. It's not a lot, but it is enough to live off of. I value you. Cool, cool story, Reggie. I'm sorry, I got it. Choose your soulmate. Jeez. I'm going with Hempleton. Propose to Hempleton. Do they get married in The Bachelor? Like, real Bachelor? Aw. Aw! <laughs> Look at him! What makes me special? Well, I mean, I don't think I'm any more special than anyone else in the world. But I also think that means no one is unimportant. I think we're all special in different ways. But I know you're special to me. Oh, I'm actually, I'm actually in love with Hempleton for real right now. Where are they now? Oh, a real rat hangs up the rat clothes for the day. An unlucky trio learns to love again. Jerry and Boris deal kiss. Hinderdean and Manello share tender moments. Ooh, yowie. <laughs> Le Artiste finds artistic inspiration in Bear. Odie makes a Max a killer outfit, and a Max is pleased. I'm gonna replay that. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna follow uh, a real rat. I want I want to know if there's anything going on there. Um, let's see. I want, I want Bear because that's my dog's name. Um, I want this asshole. Uh, <laughs> I like Garrot. <laughs> I like his face. Um, Manello is very good looking. Oh, <laughs> Mig Mouse. And, um, Hibberdine. Well, no, I, I already did Hibberdine. I guess, I didn't do a lot of Hibberdine. Let's, let's learn more about him. Usually I spend all my time working out at my lats, glutes, and delts. But taking a break from my workout is all worth it if I get to meet you. Wow. <laughs> meep, meep, meep. Oh wow. He loves that. I apply to the show because I dare to dream that someone else would love cheese as much as I do. Oh wow. <laughs> I, that's all I have to say. Oh wow. Holy shit. Wow, I can uh, barely see you. But I really like how the top of your head looks. Okay. Aw, that's cute. I like bear. I mean, I think the world is about what you give and what you get. If a tree falls in the middle of a forest and no one hears it, does it even matter? Matters if you're a bird and that tree was your house. But if you've never been to a forest, then no, it doesn't matter. Wow. No big deal, but did you know I actually should die in your flower? Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Wow. What happens if I'm really mean to them? Hey, cool cat, you ever see someone who can do two magic tricks at once? Oh, wow. I haven't, because you didn't do anything. Who gets a rose? So definitely, um, a real rat. Oh, definitely Big Mouse. Uh, I, I like Manello. And I like Bear. God, Bear is huge. Let's go with Hibberdine. I don't see what, what else he's got to say. Chit-chat. I've already forgotten all the voices. Never been much of an outgoing rat. Prefer to keep to myself. Not one for the hustle and bustle of downtown life. I've never loved the city, but I do love love. Oh, wow. Yeah, I'm not a huge fan of the city. Like, living in it, but I like going there. I'd love to get to know you better. My parents always taught me to treat others with respect and listen more than you talk. Look at me, going on and on about my family. I can't imagine what that's like. I none of the responses were good. You wanted to learn more about my work? Blah, blah, blah. Wow. I'm just skipping the dialogue because we already went through it. What? 
Oh, Hipperdine. Do you like music too? You should meet the bandmates at some point. Care for some juice? Aw, oh, love bear. Who gets a rose? A real rat? Bear? Oh, pink mouse. And let's do Hipperdean. Let's do it. These are, this is an interesting cast of characters. I used to be a lab rat. They were experimenting on me with gross serum until one day I had a gross spurt and got bigger than my cage, so they just kind of let me go wherever I wanted. I'm so sorry to hear that. What's that? I don't know what expression that is. The most up beep meep. You are so different. That is a statement of fact. Hey, on a more personal note, I've been thinking a lot about blue when I lost my tail. Blah blah. Wow. I want to be your mom. I want to date you and be your mom. I was doing some crunches earlier when you popped into my head. I couldn't stop thinking about you. It was so inspiring. I actually beat my personal record. This might sound silly, but I've <laughs> I've never felt like this before. I'm so glad you're here. Aw, oh, I love Mig Mouse. Who gets a rose? This fake rat, Mig Mouse, and, and we'll go with Bear. Telling you my personal story last time really felt good. I wonder you'd really know me. I've never felt right in my own skin. Ever since I was a little rat, I felt different from everyone else. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing here. You're so attractive and I'm just... me. And the other rats have so much to offer. It feels like I'm in high school again. I can't imagine what that's like. I'm hot. I'm hot as hell, so I can't imagine what that's like. Sometimes I like to go to the auto shop and watch them work on cars. Once I drove there, but my car was too small and they almost stepped on it. I thought it was a Hot Wheels. It's not, though. It runs on renewable energy. I'm starting to turn into that one TikTok fake ad where it's like, You ever date a twin and get confused and fuck her dad? That's what it's like to drive a Toyota. <laughs> or whatever. Um, that's nice. I do like renewable energy. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Listen, I know I'm not as flashy as some of those other rats, but I can give you what you need. A good life with a caring partner will honor and respect you every day. I'm a family rat to my core. I appreciate you sharing. I like Mig Mouse. Ah. Let's, let's do Mig Mouse. I like doing the voice. It might not be very nice to listen to, but I like it. I can't get you out of my head. I wake up every morning thinking of you. Usually I wake up thinking about protein powder. What's happening to me? I want to wake up next morning, next to you every morning, forever. Have you heard of CrossFit? I value you. I do value you, Mickey Mouse. I think it's finally time for me to show you the true me. I lied about my job. I've never been on TV. I don't even know what a TV is, if I'm honest. I have a horrible secret to tell you. Promise you won't Leave me after you find out. Oh, I can't do this. I'm too afraid. Want some juice? He's happy about that. Or she, or it, or they. I Tell me, you real rat. Tell me. Oh, show me. Show me your, your true self. Why can I clip these individual? <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Now I'm finally ready. We're actually three geckos in a costume. We're so sorry we lied to you all this time, but we were afraid you would reject us. We're also sorry that we lied about our job, but we just wanted to impress you so much. But when we saw your picture, we just knew we had to meet you. We fell in love instantly. And after getting to know you more, we've fallen more in love. We love you so much. I got three hot dudes or chicks or, or I guess they're geckos. One more time. Exclusively with people I would not date. I mean, I wouldn't date any of these people because they're rats. Money, money, money. It's all anyone sees when they look at me. Mostly because I'm usually holding money. Okay. Hold on, I'm drinking my Gatorade. Hey, uh, will you talk to me? I'm a Max, if it matters. I like to do my own thing. Thanks for sharing. Duh. 
Hi, I'm Dr. Pelagius, PhD. I studied rat history in the basements of the University of Bingham. In my spare time, I consult on human films that feature rats, such as Ratatouille and The Secret of Nim. I also like to read about major historical rat events, like those in the Victorian era, but I'll get to that later. Interesting, yuck, or very interesting. You know what? Just plain interesting. Plain interesting. Get out of my way. I'm not here to make friends. Oh, it's you. Sorry. I thought you were one of the... Actually, no. I stand by my words. I'm not here to make friends. Please get out of my way. Oh, wow. <laughs> Hotty Thespule. <laughs> like that. Being a single parent isn't easy. I've been raising these little ones myself since day one. Oh, wow. Hey, cool cat. You ever seen someone do two magic tricks at once? Oh yeah, I did kind of dabble in you a little bit. What? <laughs> They've got sunglasses on. Um, hi. I'm a little nervous. I've never done it. Nope, I'm not doing that voice. Also, why is your hand on me? Um, hi. Sorry, I'm a little nervous. I've never done anything like this before. It's just, I saw your profile and I thought you were so cute that I had to come compete. I hope that's not too embarrassing. Do you want some juice? I want to see how you drink with that on. Are you a mole, by the way? You a mole? I like your shoes. Who gets a rose? Um, I like Max. I like Lori. I like Hottie Fistbule. Um, God, there's a mosquito in my house. I like the doctor and I like Vim. Oh, it's not- holy shit, what kind of bug is that? That's not something I like to hear in the middle of a stream, when I'm easily distracted. Listen, sweetie, I don't play by the rules, so if you want to ride the Amax train, you better be ready for some freaky deaky stuff. Oh yeah, no, that's definitely a mosquito, but it's like super fat. Why are you so fat? Why are you- it's such a thick boy. I guess you're a girl. That- right? That's right? Lady mosquitoes drink blood? I don't know. Anyway, sorry, Max, I got distracted. Um, I, I'm i down for some freaky deaky stuff. Kinda look like the devil. I don't usually tell people this unless they're my close friends, but my great-great-uncle actually single-handedly brought the plague from France to Italy. That's why I love learning about the plague so much. I've actually been putting together a documentary about it that I could show you later. I don't usually show it to people, but I feel like I can really trust you. Wow. I don't like that you don't have a shirt on of me. Feel one, my respect. You need to earn it. My whole life I've been made to do by myself and work for what I got, and every time I've needed help, people let me down. Why don't you talk with commas? Just, oh wow. Yeah, that's what you get, Hottie Thespule. I love your name, though. It's time you meet my children. Reggie997, Evangeline, Esquire, Junior, Sharpie, and Trashcan. They already love you. Um, one, two, three, four, five. You have six children. Which one did you leave out? Um, also, are you related to the other Reggie? Wow, you're so different. I do like the kids. They're very cute. Dear, I can't say that I recall you mentioning it, but how did you say you scored on the SATs? I got a 1,570, which is quite good if you didn't know that. Wow, that's incredible, your highness. Or heinous? I don't know. Um, I do like Hottie. I don't, I don't know why. And a Max, a Max and Vim I love unironically. I'm, I'm not interested. The doctor's gonna give me some sort of disease. I feel like I tell you so much, and all you ever do is reply to me, but I don't know a single thing about you. What even is your name? What makes your heart beat in the morning? What do you think you deserve me, or anyone else on the show? Sounds to me like you just got lucky, and not everyone's swooning over you, but you're just like the rest of them. Don't look at me like that. Oh, guitar riff, jeez. Hey, do you want to know something? I ain't getting on the top 10 most one list of worldwide exterminators by being a good little rat and doing out what I was told. You gotta be willing to be bad. Maybe even break a few hearts along the way. That break yours? Oh, wow. No, oh, inky face. I'm a bad boy. Oh, but Vim is so stable and supportive. Reggie977 and Esquire Jr. are twins. But you wouldn't know it because Esquire Jr. is way uglier. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Um, 
Wow. Um, maybe... <laughs> Vim. Dorlene, I have to tell you, I just can't stand it when my date takes out their wallet to pay after a night out. You really think I took you to Le Restaurante Martin, expecting you to spend 17.5 thousand? Hundred? I know the chef, dear. They're an old friend. Plus, the money is nothing to me, really. Wow. Oh, but... Your Highness is so stable. Oh, I like him as well. I like a Max, and I like Highness. Oh, you called your kid ugly. <laughs> I want to see what her hottie this field goes. I'm sorry, Vim. I'm sorry. Hey, uh, I feel like when people meet, they think I'm bad to my core. But everything I do is for justice. It's so frustrating. I explain when you're ready. I should go. I don't know what kind of accent that was. I kind of fell off of it. I don't know what accent I started with in the beginning. Is this Chicagoan? Is this Boston? Somewhere somewhere in the, the Americas. Um, thanks for sharing. Aww. I like a Max. My lashes! I simply dip them in a bowl of antique charcoal each morning to get the color, and then twist them into a tip with olive oil to get the density. An old trick in my social circles. Wow, you're so different. <laughs> oh, God, it has the eyes. That's awesome. I saw you talking to every single rat in this rat cage, and now you go making eyes at me? If I asked you for your last rose, would you even give it to me? Or would you throw it at one of those other rats? Mind you, I'm not asking for anything from you. But you need to think about this decision, or maybe I'll just walk off myself. Okay. And that... What? You didn't, like... Yuck, or don't look at me like that. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, we're going through a max. Oh god, my nose is getting stuffed from doing that voice. I need to stop doing that voice. Um, so that's why I'm choosing these two. <laughs> Humans every day are out there exploring others with them. Exploiting! Excuse me, not exploring others. That's a little too freaky deaky for me. Um, they're exploiting others with the money and power. I like to sneak in the evil one's houses and give them a bit of a scare. Been dodging extermination on Wall Street since 09. Now you know my secret. I value you. Aww. I'm only used to looking through people, but when I look at you, I feel like I'm looking right at you. It makes me feel like maybe you wouldn't use me? I wouldn't use you, Lord. I mean, I would let you pay for a bunch of shit. Know that I will bring nothing financially to the table in this relationship, but in every other way, I'll, I'll, I'll be there for you. Oh. Oh, I don't know. <sighs> See, Max is a sexy bad boy, and I know I'm gonna get adventure through my life. But Lori is gonna give me stability, financially, and I think emotionally. <sighs> but once again, I feel like a Max brings some sort of sensuality and intensity to the relationship, but with Lori, I feel safety and, and love. Well, Jeff, my soulmate, the person I'm giving my final rose to, it's gonna be Highness Lori. Aw, look at us. A little gloves. Whoa. Also, I've been using him and her pronouns, so I don't know what- I don't know. <laughs> I've spent my whole life focused on building an empire, and I'd give anything to share it with you. My fortune, my place on the throne, my fancy diamonds. I just want you, and I want all those things as well. <laughs> I love you, and I want to be with you forever. Oh, that kind of scares me. Maybe I should have gone with the max. Uh-oh. Egg salad fulfills their dream of opening a bakery. New friends realize how much they have in common. Aww. Okay. Okay, that's the last time. I've gotta stop playing this. 